The Federal Investigation Office sought a house in Southern Carolina as part of a criminal civil rights investigation containing racial discrimination allegations on Wednesday. According to the incident reports, the search comes shortly after Horry County's two residents, Alexis Page Hartnett and Worden Evander Butler, who has set up a cross over a black neighbor's house in Corbett Drive, and was accused of harassing for fire in late November, reviewed by CBS News. CBS News affiliate WBTW was outside the house. As both White Butler, both White and Hartnett, he held his hands in the air to prevent it. Worden Butler raised his arms to avoid being photographed, WBTW according incident report. In addition to Hartnett Butler's cross-combustion claim, Hartnett Butler harassed followed racially motivated words actions and followed neighbors, and before racial slurry shouting, he tried interrupt business at neighbor's house. According to the police report, the neighbors said Hartnett Butler were afraid that they could raise their behavior beyond cross. Burning in their behavior has become more often threatening. In interview recorded after a cross combustion claim, Hartnett heard that even if they interviewed by police officers, he heard that neighbor used racial slurry for his family and ignored officers return to house, he said. I don't care if Satan called Army of Satan and I didn't go down same boat. In a second incident report, civil servants said Hartnett screamed to civil servants, believing that it should not be on the property, and Butler was a trench around the property. FBI agents and Alexis Hartnett, Center, WBTW The couple was arrested for the couple arrested on 30 November. Hartnett was accused of second-degree harassment and third-degree attack battery according to online records. The arrest order said that Hartnett said in a police interview that he had killed a black woman in the past according to WBTW. South Carolina is one of two states without hate crime laws based on race, sexual orientation, gender or gender identity, but the criminal civil rights investigation undertaken by FBI is federal. According to a FBI news bulletin, agency is working with the U.S. law office and local and state partners in investigation.